Okay, I kind of thought it was time to give you guys an update on how I'm going with my almost autonomous snowblower. Well, here it is. I've got it mostly done. Uh, so let me tell you what I've got. Okay, um, I've got uh, two uh, marine deep cycle battery, 12 volt batteries in series. Uh, give me 24 volts. I've got that going through a uh, toggle switch. I had to buy a 15 amp toggle switch from Granger. Um, and then in here, okay, so I've got, I'm using a, a lot of uh, amps on this uh, motor for the blower. So I bought a, a 30 amp relay over here, 24 volt 30 amp relay <clears throat> to put in there. Um, and that was to run everything, because everything else, I shorted out my first couple of toggle switches because it was had way too many amps. Uh, so anyway, then I've got over here a uh, Sabertooth 225 motor controller, dual motor controller. I'm using that uh, for the uh, uh, electric wheelchair motors I've got on here. You can probably see them back there. Uh, that's what's running the wheels. Then um, I've got a, also a 24 volt, uh, if you can see that, 24 volt uh, single uh, motor controller. Uh, that's running the uh, uh, heavy duty 10 amp lineal actuator right here that turns the, uh, the uh, front of the uh, snowblower to one direction or the other. And that works pretty cool. Um, and then of course the front of it is just a regular snowblower. I, I uh, found one that I tore apart, cleaned up, and, and the base is there, and then I got this. I built the uh, center here so that it can pivot, and of course turn with that lineal actuator that I've got in there. Uh, to uh, pull this, I had the uh, AR610 uh, receiver right there with an antenna, and I have the uh, Spectrum DXE uh, transmitter, which works pretty good. So, you know, yeah, and that's what it is, and, and it does work. Uh, let me fire this up here, show you some pretty little lights on there. Nothing smoking, so that's always a good thing. <laughs> and, uh, oh, let's see here. Okay. Well, will it go? Ooh. Yep, it moves. Yep. Pops a wheelie there. Yeah, there you go, Dan Burke. It proves it'll probably fly. Yeah, okay. And then here you can see that lineal actuator working. And, uh... Yep. Yeah. It turns pretty fast there, doesn't it? <laughs> That's probably not good on the batteries and everything, but anyway, so you can see what it's doing and uh, I'll keep you updated as much as I can. Talk to you later. Bye.